Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi. I was I was like facing some problems with the internet and I was like, why did this happening? I don't know, man. Since I, I came I came home like 15 minutes ago, the internet was working fine. But now it's like like very slow, very like don't know why this so Quedado, quedado congelada la imagen, Se escucha cortado, teacher. Ah, my God. Give me a second. I'm going I'm I'm to try to I, I investigate what is going on. Okay. Give me a second, people. Just give me a couple of minutes. I'm going to try to connect from the internet of my, my phone. So let's see what's going on here. All right, how about now? Can you listen to me now? Hola, hola. Si se escucha, pero cortado. Oh my God, again. Si se escucha, pero bien cortado. Really? I'm listening to you, uh, but give me, give me a second, give me a second. La imagen se congela, teacher. Hola, Eric, buen provecho. Uh, I'm trying to see what can I do with this. Just give me a couple of seconds, please. Because I got problems. All right, hello, everybody. Are you there? Me escuchan ahora? Yes. Ok, ¿no me escuchan Por... cortado ahora? <risa> no. For the moment. Ok. Ah, me es que tuve... escucha un poco mejor. Ah, perfecto. Es que tuve que reiniciar el modem. No sé qué pasa con el internet. Que inclusive el del celular está fallando bastante. Entonces tuve que reiniciar todo. Ah, espero que ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. No me esté dando esos, esos problemitas. Los, los, los problemas. All right. Uh, I'm not really sorry for 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 uh, making you to wait those ten minutes, but we're gonna start in soon, okay? With this with this information, so just just give me a second. I'm reporting this. No. Okay. All right. So I'm going to pass the attendance list because like we're kind of behind. Uh, I, I'm truly sorry for, for the issue. I didn't have internet before, but now I, 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 I think the problem is solved. Creo que el problema se solucionó. Espero. Espero que sí. I hope so. Pero sí. 
Ahora sí, ya veo, <risa> ya veo a Carla. Ay, ay, Carla, justo cuando la, la estaba mencionando y me apaga la cámara. Pero ya veo moverse a Carla y a, y a, y a Diana. <risa> That's a good sign. Solo Eric ahí todo sofisticado con su, con su foto. <risa> What's up, Eric? <risa> ay, qué chévere. ¿Cómo estamos? Good. ¿Y tú? Con hambre. Con hambre. <risa> Angry. You know what? Yo igual traí una, una mega hiper gran hambre. Y le digo a mi esposa, hey, listen, a llegaré tarde. Porque llegamos tarde, le digo, para, para, para. Y no creo que le dé tiempo de cocinar o, o algo así. Entonces me dice, ahí está una little six hermes. Vaya, compre una. <risa> and we were, I mean, we, we were on the way home and we were eating. So, like, <laughs> like, when I got here, I mean, I was full. Yeah, mm. Food yeah, is pues, good. Yeah, yeah, pues, algo similar venía yo con una hambre. <laughs> Comí, pero al ratito ya estaba con hambre. Traje que estoy comiendo. <laughs> y así como que, bueno, well, de vez en yeah. cuando. Yeah. Bien insinuante <laughs> eso. <¿verdad>? Exactly. <laughs> Exactly. <risa> ah, bueno, los que nos toca andar así corriendo de un lado a otro, right? es lo que nos toca. Yeah. All right, people. I'm, I'm going to start with the tennis list uh, just to begin with the class. Este día tenemos un tema bastante interesante ah, en el cual vamos a tener bastante práctica. All right, today we're going to start with the, uh, with the future. Vamos a ver el futuro utilizando una, una estructura bastante interesante que no habíamos uh, uh, practicado eh, en, en, en los módulos pasados ni en las semanas pasadas. So that's going to be kind of interesting. So let's start with the attendance list. Ana Claribel is not here. Ana María. Ne. Diana Gabriela. Present. Nah, ok, thank you Diana. Eric Guillermo. Eric. Present teacher. Nah, ok, very good. Ever de Jesús. Present teacher. Se, fri se frizó. Fly again. Ah, I hate when that happens. Present. Ok, thank you, Ever. Espero no pase seguido. Ah, Fátima Alejandra. Ah, it's not here. All right, just give me a couple of seconds. I think I have I have problems again. Just give me a second. Give me a second. Hmm, probably right now we don't have problems. So let's see. Fatima is not here. Flo Italia not here. Hilmar Cruz. Present. Ah, okay, very good. Jonathan Alexander, hmm, no here. Carla Benacer. Present. Okay, perfect. Natalie Vanessa, no here. Nubia Zulema. Present, teacher. Hi, Nubia. Hi, Hi teacher. You look like, like very happy tonight. <laughs> All the time, right, Nubia? Siempre. Always. Siempre. siempre. <laughs> That's the yeah. attitude. That's the attitude. <laughs> yes. Uh, let's see. Romeo Alexis. It's not here. Rosa del Carmen. No here. Roxana Yesenia. is not here. Salvador Alfonso. Creo que Salvador está enfermo. <risa> Se volvió a poner la segunda dosis. Y creo que no, no la va a hacer esta noche. Ya, yeah, mira, I've been texting him. And le, digo, le, le, le dije que se trate de conectar. Pues. Tres dosis lleva ya. <risa> ¿Ah? ¿Cuántas? <risa> yeah, not, I don't know why, I mean, but 
I think he's 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 like kind of kind of bad of health. So Sarah Carolina, no here. Uh, Stephanie Lisset, come on, everybody's not here. Uh, let's see. William it has not connected. Joanne, no here. All right, and the last one, Stephanie Janet. Present. Uh, hey, Stephanie, you look really nice in in your in your stories. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I just come over. Y ella es Stephanie, qué feliz se ve. Es que por aquí es otra cosa. No, pues sí, ya, yeah, ya, yeah. otro nivel. Bien feliz ahí. Sí. That's, that's cool. That's cool. Claro. <laughs> that's great. Okay. So uh, I'm going to share the presentation that we're going to have for, for tonight. Give me a second. Where did I go? Nah, not this. This is the presentation that we're going to have for tonight. Solo me confirman, por favor, si pueden ver la presentación. No es el que esté frisado. <risa> ya no sé ni cuándo voy a estar frisado. Ok, pero me lo hacen saber, por favor, cuando quede ahí todo así como medio raro. All right. Uh, this is the video conference. 17 people. Three more video conferences besides this one. And we finish the module. Ooh, really funny. Excuse me, teacher. Yes. Este, ya mandaron el... ¿Cómo se llama? La encuesta de satisfacción. Bueno, a mí ya me cayó. Perfect. Eh, recordemos, no la vayan a hacer. Ok, perfecto. No, all right, perfect. Uh, thank you, Stephanie. Eh, no la vayan a hacer. La vamos a hacer el jueves acá. Ok, in the class. Así por si surge alguna duda o something, acá la vamos, a, lo, la vamos a hacer. Siempre la hemos hecho acá, así que igual vamos a dedicar un par de minutos durante la clase para poderla desarrollar. Así que Please don't do it by your own. Let's do it here in the classroom. All right. So let's continue. The topic that we're going to have for tonight is how to use be going to. Esta es una nueva estructura. Que creo que no la habíamos visto antes. But is related to simple future. Okay. Si recordamos, eh, generalmente hemos estado viendo eh, el, el, el futuro con will. Right. Eh, eh, en, las, en los temas pasados ok, but now it's gonna be different ahora, este es una nueva estructura, be going to right eh, que nos sirve para formular oraciones a futuro ok, just to create sentences in future so we're gonna be using this structure throughout this video conference, we're gonna practice a conversation and we're gonna practice uh, some questions you know uh, in order to to get to know with this with this structure, creo que algunos al, algunos inconvenientes o algunas cositas se van a solucionar ahora para algunos de ustedes que me estaban preguntando sobre precisamente sobre el, la tarea de esta de este tema, All right? The uses of be going to. So we're gonna do that and we're gonna do a series of questions uh, as well, right? So let's start with that. Okay, to start, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna start with the with the class agenda. Okay. And the first thing that we got for tonight is the review from previous topic. Let's start a little bit with that. We're not gonna stop that much with that topic because uh, with that review because we got a lot of information to share tonight. But let's review a little bit what we were doing last class. What do you guys remember from last class? What was the main topic? Or what do you remember? Travel plans. Ah, okay, very good. We were talking about traveling plans. Okay, very good. What else do you remember? Will you mind? Will you mind? Ah, uh -huh. but specifically, uh, Stephanie, uh, this past Friday. Um, Do we remember what was the topic from last Friday? I mean, 
Ajá. Eh, <risa> sobre las suggestions también creo que una, tocamos eso. Ajá, ok. What else? ¿Qué más? What is related to, 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 to last uh, class? Vocabulary, Book. teacher. Ah, we were, okay, we were talking yeah, about hotel. vocabulary. Okay, vocabulary related to hotel. Related to hotel. Ah, okay. All right, very good, right? We were the talking about that. Uh -huh. The hotel service and amenities, how to make one reservation. Ah, okay, very good. That was basically the topic about, right? The how, how to make a hotel reservation. And we were sharing vocabulary related to hotels, okay? So that's pretty much what this class is going to be focused on. At least the beginning of the class, we're gonna have some questions to discuss, okay? Related to that. So after the review of that topic that we got last class, we're gonna have a short conversation. After the conversation, we're going to have the structure be going to, right? Just for us to, to, to get to know this. And then, of course, we're going to have some exercises. And at the end, we're going to work on the manual. So this is pretty much what we have for tonight. So what are we going to start with? We're going to start with this. Questions to discuss. First question. Uh, let's see who's there. Carla, help me at reading this question, please. Okay, teacher. Do you prefer to stay in mother um or antique? Antique or antique antique hotels when you travel? No, nah, okay. This question goes for everybody. Listen up. Do you prefer to stay in modern or antique hotels when you travel? Antique is those old um, hotels. Antique viene de la palabra, viene el significado como antiguo, viejo, right? All right. When, when, when you like make reserva hotel reservations to go on vacation, so to go to seminaries, training, whatever you're going to, do you like to stay in a modern hotel or an antique one? Ever, in your case? Which one do you prefer? Generally, uh, modern hotels, but right. it depends. It, it depends when we have to make, we have to go into one tour and I have one option about the hotel. I want, and Chick Hotel uh, mm -hmm. is that in good conditions? Maybe, maybe I, we vamos, del vez vamos. But generally, uh, with my family, when we have traveled to, to vacations, vacations, uh huh, and vacations, I'm I'm, I'm modern hotels. Nah, a modern one. Huh? Okay, very good. Uh, Nubia, how about you? I prefer the modern. Modern one? Why? Because the structure, the decoration, mm -hmm. the different uh, place, the activities. Nah. Okay. All right. That, that's why you prefer a modern one and not an antique one. Okay. Good. Uh, Hilma, how about you? I prefer modern, modern hotels. Uh -huh. Why? Because uh, the connection, uh, internet. <laughs> the internet connection. Nah, okay, all right. Vital connection. The connection, internet. Yeah. Ah, por ejemplo, salas de juego, como hay hoteles que tienen como medio casinos. 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Ah, yeah, I mean, they, they, they got those things included. Solo eso, creo. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, Eric? Uh-huh. Okay. Eric? How about you? Uh, I prefer uh, stay in, in modern hotel, in a, in a modern hotel, hotel. Uh -huh. uh, in one occasion in Guatemala. Uh, I stayed in an um, old hotel, mm -hmm. hotel. Mm -hmm. and I feel... I, I felt? Feel, I felt uh, uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. Because, uh -huh. uh, because the lies uh, 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 are. Where? Uh, uh, no, es que las luces eran muy, muy tétricas. No sé cómo decirlo. Eso, como que the, era... light, the lights were very tétric. Really? Uh, really. Sí. Mm, única vez. <laughs> <laughs> and because I prefer the 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 more hotel hotel, it's better, right? It's even better. the even even the bedrooms. I mean, you know, like yes. the beds and everything. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. I, I I understand you. Yeah, understand your point, Mrs. Posada. How about you? I prefer uh, I in a modern. Modern one? Why? Because uh, for the structure and more comfort. No, okay. You feel more comfortable when you are in one of those hotels. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just imagine an earthquake comes. It's like an earthquake. You might feel that the, the walls are going to fall and kill you. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I understand you. All right. Uh, who else? William, how about you? What kind of hotel do you prefer when you go on vacation? An antique one or a modern one? Um, I prefer a hotel modern. Uh -huh. because, Why? Because because it's uh, it's more beautiful. Ah, uh -huh, okay, more beautiful. Uh, uh -huh. Because the because the technology is uh, okay. important in in this in this life in this moment. Ah, uh -huh. yeah, I mean that that that, that is cool. And I, I understand your point because the, the in... hotel, the hotel antique, mm -hmm. the hotel, the antique hotel is beautiful, but. The technology is, is important. Yes. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes, I know. I mean, it, most of the antique hotels, they don't have like good access to internet, for example. They don't have plasmas, like, like, like to put it as, as an example, right? They, 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 they just got like on a small TV. In some cases, they don't even have Wi Fi. So uh, for people who work, that is like something very uncomfortable because they need to have access to internet and all those things. All right, now I, I understand your, your, your point, uh, William. Thank you. Fatima, how about you? I prefer modern hotels. Ah, uh, because... La comodidad. Muddy. Yeah, it's more comfortable. Yes. Uh -huh. For technology. Uh -huh. Is es más accesible todo. O sea, aunque eh, sí creo que los los hoteles antiguos, o sea, tienen su historia. Uh -huh. Y o sea, es bonito conocer a veces, pero prefiero is modern hotels. Nah, okay. All right. Okay, very good, Fatima. Sara, in your case, which one do you prefer? Um, she prefers hotel more. Um, 
Me queda mezcla, quizás. <ríe> ok, mix. Eh, eh, una mezcla de lo, de lo antiguo, pero un toque moderno. Ah, ajá, ajá. Ah, Podría ok. Ser, pero y los países, depends uh, on the place. Mm, ah, ok, depends on the place too. Mm -hmm. Ok, that's, that's pretty cool. So let's see, another, another participation, and I continue with another question. Diana, are you there? Yes. Okay, Diana. Which or what kind of hotel do you prefer? An active one or a modern one? I prefer a um, vintage hotel. <laughs> uh -huh. Why? Um, because for uh, I feel more more acogedor. More like 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 comfortable. Uh, I like to see uh, the old look. Mm -hmm. uh, I creo me transmite paz. <laughs> no, no sé, okay. me gusta más lo. Lo antiguo, para mí es lo antiguo. Ah, all right. Prácticamente mm. si voy a un hotel, yo me voy a desconectar de todo. ¿verdad? I disconnect from the world. <laughs> all right, especially when you go on vacation. Okay. Uh, you're, you're like kind of similar to me, especially when I go like to the beach, to say like that. When I go like for two days, what I do is like, I look for a place in which, okay, you can have access to internet, but I try to disconnect from everything. Why? Because in that way you can enjoy what you're doing or what you're like, like, like you know, or going in there. That's a good way too, right? But as you know, like mo most, mo most of the people nowadays, uh, their jobs don't let them to be disconnected. Because there are cases in which you are like supposed to be on vacation, but you're like like every every time you are like getting calls from everybody and like like trying to solve problems. I think that happens to 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 people like Eric. So probably Eric is in one day off, and Eric is like like getting calls from people in their job. Or am I wrong, Eric? Isn't it like that? <laughs> you, don't, you don't know how to put that. In. <laughs> okay. All right, Eric, take, take your time. While you're taking your time, I'm going to go into the second question. Ah, Natalie's coming. Hi, Natalie. Were you, Hi, teacher. Were you sleeping, Natalie? No, teacher. No, a pesar de que madrugué ahora, pero no ando con sueño, la verdad. Ah, okay, okay. Y a las Good. cuatro. Uh -huh. Really? Sí. You woke up very early in the morning? Why? Sí, me tocó entrar a las seis de la mañana al trabajo. Ah, oh. sí. So sorry. Pero... Sí, pero todavía no. Creo que todavía aguanto lo que resta de la clase. <laughs> <laughs> ok, ok. All right. Yeah, you got it. Ok. All right, Eric, I read the message. Teacher, puede enviar esa, esa, la presentación al grupo, por favor. Uh, this one? Mm -hmm. All right, I will, I, will, I will send it to the group as far as I... I, I, I stop sharing but i need to share some some information from here okay later on okay. i will send it i will send it okay me recuerda más tarde por favor because i tend to forget the things okay next question do you usually make your hotel reservations or someone else does it for you do you think in that case people what do you usually do do you make the phone reservation or somebody else does it for you I make reservation. Ah, in that case, you made your own reservation. Nobody else okay. does it for you? No. 
Ah, okay, all right. That one is cool. Sorry, teacher. Ah, disculpe. Ah, no problem, mister. I know, like sometimes, like the word calls, you need. Justamente eso es lo que le, le, le decía. A veces usted está en un day off y a lo mejor está recibiendo llamadas like from people from your work, right? You see? Uh, the better example. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. That's, that, that's a good example. Okay. Uh, but let's continue with this. Uh, let's see. Ana Maria, are you there? Yes, t Qué calladita entrada, Ana María. Ah, hace rato entré. Ah, pues sí, ya ve, calladita. Anteriormente, en los días, semanas anteriores, una gran bulla se traía con entrar. Ay, qué exagerado. <risa> no, Ana María, ¿cómo te sientes con tus injuries? The usually make the, your reservations. Hotel? No, 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 no. I, I was I was asking to you about your injury, sobre tus lesiones. ¿Cómo va? Justo me estoy quitando todas las cáscaras. Eso estaba haciendo. Me estoy quitando todo lo de la rodilla que está horrible, que ya quiero que desaparezca. What? Hey, but that's that, that, that yeah, is... Yeah, But come on, Ana Maria, that's protecting you. You know what? I love to do that too. Me encanta hacer eso y mi esposa siempre me regaña. Nunca se le va a curar, me sí, yo, si lo deja, está bien, está bien. Así que no lo haga. Le va a volver a sangrar. Sí, no, ya, ya se secó. Ya solo los moretes han quedado. Ah. Pero ya sí, gracias a Dios, ya la inflamación. Lo que pasa es que por pasar mucho tiempo sentada, quizás la mala circulación es la que ah, hace que anda. se me vuelva a inflamar. Porque ya. sábado y domingo no, no tenía nada. Ah. De inflamado. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Nice. Pero como los días de semana estoy 10 horas sentada. Uh -huh. Long time, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. got sí. that issue. Uh -huh. All right. All right. But let's continue, Ana Maria. Do you usually okay. make your, your, your hotel reservations or, or someone else does it for you? In general, uh, make it a reservation when. Generalmente, uh. sí. Lo you hago una reservación. Yes. Ah, you do it. Nobody else does it for you. Nadie más lo hace por usted. No. No, ah, yo tengo okay. que hacerlo por mí. Ok. Very exit, exit, exit. Ok. Ya. Yeah. Si Good. no, no lo hacen como yo quiero las cosas. Ah, ok. Gotta do it by yourself. Ah. Mm -hmm. All right. Good. Mrs. Posada, how about you? Um... You do In it or castle, somebody else do it? Um, I like someone else to do it. I'm not complicated. <laughs> you, don't, you don't complicate? But, but do you give the indications about what you want? I guess, or not? Yes. No, okay. No simplemente es que, ah, <laughs> eh, sí, hazla tú y bla, 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 uh, bla. Uh, you get the indications indication. about what you want. <laughs> now, nah, okay. Interesting. There you go. All right. I was just like, like to open up, right? Like a, a short conversation. Now, let's jump into what really matters in this in this video conference. The uses of be going to. But listen, before starting with the main structure, I want we to practice the, the short conversation that we got here because I don't want to do it at the end. Let's remember that we use be going to, to create, listen up, to create future actions, okay? Future events. But let's start practicing this short conversation in order to continue. Ahora lo vamos a hacer de una manera un tanto diferente. Antes hacíamos la pequeña conversación casi al final. Después de ver la estructura, ahora vamos a practicar la conversación y luego ver la estructura, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. That's going to be a little bit different, ¿ok? All right, what are we going to do with this information? Similar as we have been doing before, we are going to read the conversation, we are going to practice it, ¿ok? And after practicing it here, you 
you in pairs are going to practice it, but in here in the main section. Okay, so this is a conversation between Jen and Gerardo, right? So remember, every word that you do not understand, write it down. And at the end of the practice, let me know and I will give you the translation. All right, it says, hello, listen, hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? This is Jen. How can I help you? It says Gerardo. Hello, I need to make a reservation. Hello, I need to make a reservation. And it says Jen. Give me a second. Sure. Sure. May I have your name, please? May I have your name, please? And it says Gerardo. Of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. Of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. And it says Jen. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. Are you going to arrive? I mean, when are you going to arrive? And it says, Gerardo, I'm going to arrive. Listen up. I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. On Friday 14th. And it says, yeah, how long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? And it says, Gerardo, I'm going to stay until Monday. I'm going to stay until Monday. And it says, yeah. Are you going to make the reservation? Snap. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? For a single or a double room? And it says, Gerardo, a single room, please. A single room, please. All right, people, from here, do you have any question related to the vocabulary here? Probably something with pronunciation, a word that you don't remember, something? Oh, everything is okay. Is it everything clear? ¿Estamos claros con el, el vocabulario? ¿Hay alguna pregunta en cuanto a pronunciación? ¿Alguna palabra que no conozcamos? Yo, teacher. Ajá, tell me. Uh, Until. Uh -huh. Hasta. Ah, uh, ok. Yeah, hasta. Until. All right. Any other question related to the vocabulary? Fátima, Natalie, Rosana, Sara, Carla, Diana. Any question? Should I write? Huh? Any question, Should Diana? I arrive. Arrive means llegar. To get to a place. Llegar a un lugar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Sure. Yes. Thank you. Uh, uh, until is synonymous to. I, I'm sorry, I didn't listen. Until uh, is synonymous de, de to. Eh, it's likely similar. Depende del contexto en que lo utilicemos, puede que sea que sí o pueda que no. Right. Until, in this case, it is mostly used alone. 
es más que todo usada para decir a, hasta el día en que, en, que, en que finaliza algo. To es algo similar, solo que antes de to usted tiene que colocar from. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Tiene que mencionar día en el que empieza y día en el que, de que finaliza. Por ejemplo, the class, dice nada, the class is from, from 8 to 10. Okay. Es de 8 a 10. Ok. Uh -huh. Entonces es como más a. A. Ok. To. Uh, related to, to, to that. Entonces, until es como hasta. Eh, acá. Si quiero okay. decir que las clases son de lunes a viernes. Ah, clases are from Monday to Friday. Y otro ejemplito donde se ocupa until. Until. Ok. We have classes until Thursday. Ah, tenemos clases hasta este jueves. You see? That we finish the module. Okay. okay? That we basically end up the classes. Que aparentemente ya finalizamos clase. All right? Module. And probably, probably, probably you're going to have a new teacher for module four. That's okay. excellent. Thank you. Okay, good. So let's keep going. All right, what are we going to do? Lo que le digo, thank you, este Hilmar, me fue cuando usted dijo que iba a nuevo teacher. Thank you, le dice Hilmar. O sea, así como que, okay, thank you, next. Qué valor, qué valor. I haven't, I, yeah, I mean, it, it hurt my heart. En el cora, como dicen. Y el que cayó otorga ya no dijo nada, ya ve. Ah, exactly, man. Es que me hubiera dicho que dicen que el que la usa es el que se la imagina, ¿verdad? Uh, okay. All right. Es un bicho bien sabio. Después de esas pedradas, let's continue. Ok, what are we going to do right now? Let's practice this short conversation that we got here. Ok, how are we going to do it? I want Ever and Nubia to start. Right now, okay, we're gonna go, we're not gonna go to, to, you know, like, like on, uh, on short groups, probably gonna do it at the end with that. Okay, I, I want ever, I know we have to practice this conversation. I want, let's see, Gerardo is gonna be uh, ever, and know is gonna be Jen. Let's start. Okay, hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I, I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name please? Of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I am going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make a reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. No, okay, very good. Thank you, Ever, and thank you, Nubia. You did it excellent. Now, Eric and Fatima. Same position. All right, Eric is going to take the action of Gerardo and Fatima uh, Jen. Okay. Hello, thank you you're for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? This is Jen. Hello. Mm -hmm. Hello, I need to make a, a reservation. Sure, may I have your name please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday the 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay, very good. Thank you, Eric, and thank you, Fatima. You did it excellent. 
Now I went, I went Hilmar and Roxana. Hilmar, B, Gerardo, and Roxana, Jen. Okay. Roxana? Inicia Hilmar. Na, you, Roxana. Ah, yo, va. Yes. <laughs> Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jean. How can I I help you? Okay. Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, excellent. Um, in the second, I want to make bigger this. All right, thank you, Helmer, and thank you, Roxana. Now, let's do it, uh, Sara and Ana Maria. Okay. Okay. Can I can? Ana, start. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yo inicio. Yes. Okay. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Reservation? Reservation? Sure. sure, may I have your name, please? Sure, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Gomez. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay use us, Mr. Gomez? With us. With us, Mr. Gomez. I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay, very good. Thank you, Ana Maria. And uh, Sara, you did it excellent. Now, let's see who's coming up. Carla and, uh, let me see, can I put up and then, Romeo, are you there? Yes. Okay, okay. okay Romeo, be Gerardo and, and Carla, Jen. Okay. Hello, thank you for the call in the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are when are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 5th, 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 4th, 14th, 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 How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay on the Monday. Are you going to make the reservation? A single room, please. <laughs> Carla, something was missing. Ah. Yeah, I have made up. Are you going to make the reservation? <laughs> going to make the reservation for a single double row? Ah, okay. You ask Romeo, read, read the last one, Romeo. Ya no se alcanzó a ver, teacher. Ah, dele. Creo. Ah, single room, please. A ver, ah. es el último que alcanzó a ver. Ajá, that's the last one, Romeo. That's the last one. Ese es el último. 
Ah, ok. Ok. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Romeo. Ok. That was funny. Ok. Let's continue. Uh -huh. Diana, are you there? Yes. Ok, perfect. Ah, you're going to practice with William. William, are you there? Yes. All right, William. Be Gerardo and, uh, and, and let me see. Diana is going to be Jen. Hello. Thank you. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jane. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I, Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mrs. Gomez, Mr. Gomez. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday, 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, thank you, William. And uh, okay. where, where is the name of it, this person? Okay, uh, Diana. <laughs> All right, Natalie, are you there? Oh, yeah, Natalie, the sleepy <laughs> Natalie. No, teacher, right. que se me enredó el audífono en el pelo. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna put you to work with your best friend. What is your best friend? <laughs> ah. La Urrutia. <laughs> Miren la señorita Urrutia tirando salsa bien arregladita. Miren el cabello. As. Para que vean que voy a salir ahora. Mentira. <laughs> para que vean para que vean que me bañé. <laughs> que me bañé, cabrón. <laughs> All right, yeah. no. you look cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's practice this conversation. Natalie, start. Okay. Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Yang. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? <clears throat> of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room. Please. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Mrs. Rutia and Natalie. You did it excellent. You're welcome. Okay, good. Who's next? Jonathan, are you there? Yeah, I mean, Jonathan has been very quiet. <laughs> okay. All right, Jonathan. I want you to practice with uh, uh, Mrs. Posada. Okay. Yeah. All right, Jonathan, B. Gerardo, and she's gonna be Jen. Okay. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When, when are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, perfect. Okay. Thank you, Jonathan, and thank you. Uh, where is it? Ha, ah, Mrs. Janet. Uh, you did okay. it. Excellent. Now let's see mm -hmm. who's missing. 
It's missing. Ah, Rosa. Rosa. Are you there, Rosa? Hi, Rosa. <laughs> Aprovecha, Rosa. Gracias. Okay, Rosa. I, I think I, I think you're eating, Rosa. No problem, Rosa. Continue eating, Rosa. Right? Uh, let's see who's missing. Um, mm -hmm. Ana Garcia, are you there? Hi, Ana. Okay, Ana. I need you to practice this conversation with me, Ana. Uh, lo voy a leer como pueda, porque me acabo de conectar y hay unas palabras. No. Ah, ok, I, uh, I will help you up, no problem. Start, Ana. Uh, hello, thank you. You for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? Arrive. Arrive. Okay. I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Us. With ah, us. Pardon? With us. We at Mr. Gomez, ¿verdad? Yes. I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or single? a single? Sing? Single. Single. Yes. Or a double room? Double. Repeat again, Anna. Double. Da, double. Double. Uh -huh. Double. Double uh, room. Okay. A single room, please. Okay. Thank you, Anna. That was good. That was really good. All right. What are we going to do now, people? Now that we got an idea how to make this type of sentences and questions into future, because the whole conversation is in future. Si ve, la mayor parte de la conversación está basada en una acción a futuro. Why future? Porque ellos están hablando sobre una reservación que se llevará a cabo right, en una fecha a futuro. Okay? That's why they are using be going to. But let's talk a little bit about this structure. That's what we're going to be doing right now. All right, be going to. That is the main structure that we got. Structure. Let's start a little bit with the structure of this. And check this out. This is the structure that we need to create affirmative statements using this, okay, uh, this, 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 uh, I'm going to say this, tense. Actually, not tense. It has to be structure. Okay, we got subject plus be going to plus base form of verb. Aquí usamos la forma base del verbo, ¿ok? Base form of the verb plus complement. And it says, uh, let's see, Rosa, help me out reading this, please. We use... We use... Yes. We use the going to, 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 describe, to, to describe... Describe? We use... Be going to to describe schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future. Now, okay, very good. Thank you, Rosa. So this is pretty much about uh, when to use this structure. Listen up. We use be going to to describe and schedule activities. Listen up. To describe schedule activities. What are the schedule activities? Para describir acciones que ya están previamente planificadas o agendadas, que sí o sí van a suceder. All right, for planned activities, we use be going to. 
And it says, and activities that will definitely happen in the future. Y actividades que definitivamente sucederán en el futuro. Something that is already established. Okay. Example. Mrs. Janet, read it, please. Um, I am going to have class tomorrow night. Now, okay, very good. I am going to have class tomorrow night. What does it mean? Aquí, ¿de qué estamos hablando? Estamos hablando sobre una actividad futuro que está previamente planificada hasta con hora específica, okay? And what is the hour? From 8 to 10. So you see, that is a very established Okay, um, schedule for this activity. And what is the main structure? Listen up. Cuando hablamos de be going to, okay, en la estructura tenemos el subject. Remember, the subject can be any pronoun that we have been discussing in the past. Puede ser cualquier pronombre, okay? Maybe I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they, right? Remember that. And after that, depending on the subject, we got be going to. Pero recordemos que no vamos a colocar en la oración be going to. ¿Por qué? Porque el verbo be, recordemos, en presente simple, ¿cuántos, cuántos, ¿cuántas de derivaciones tiene? You remember them? ¿Cuántas formas tiene en presente simple el verbo to be? Come on, Dos. people. Uh, one more, William. One more. The verb will be or yes. is. Ah, okay. Y para primera persona, William. Um. There you go. There you have. Very good. <laughs> ¿Qué pasó con los demás? Se les olvidó. Mm. Mm. Okay. Remember, in simple present, when we use the verb be, we got am. Um, is and are three forms am um, is are ok dependiendo del sujeto del pronombre que utilicemos así va a ser la forma del verbo to be que vamos a colocar en la estructura porque no vamos a colocar be going to ese be tiene que ser ya sea am um, is or are depending on the context ok example in here look I am going to have class tomorrow night. I am. Ahí ya sustituimos be por am. ¿Por qué? Porque tenemos I como pronombre. Y luego going to. So, ese I'm going to es lo que forma el futuro. ¿Ok? That's what makes the sentence to be in future. Luego have es el verbo en forma base. All right? And then class tomorrow night. That's the complement of the sentence, all right? All right, another example. Uh, let's see who's next. Ever help me out reading this example, please. You are going to work next week. No, okay. You are going to work next week. That is something that is definitely going to happen in the future, all right? That is a schedule activity. You are going to work next week. And what happened here? Look, ya ahora ya no es am en la forma del verbo to be, ya es are. Why? Porque tenemos you, right? So you are going to work next week. Eric, read. She's going to prepare dinner. All right, very good. She is going to prepare dinner, right? Those are future actions. Recordemos, acá todas son acciones futuras, right? In a zone how we are like creating actions in the future, okay? Example, people. What are the activities that you plan to do tomorrow or this week? ¿Podrían mencionarme una actividad o plan que tengan para esta semana o este fin de semana próximo using be going to? For example, for example, in my case, I am going, listen up, 
I am going to take my car to the car wash this weekend. So in this case, I'm talking about a future action, all right? But let's see, what are those future actions that you're going to do this week? Can somebody give me an example? Les voy a dar un minuto para que piensen y me escriban un ejemplo usando esto. Ok, una acción a futuro que ustedes tengan que hacer esta semana. It doesn't matter any activity, all right? The idea is that you write or that you tell me one activity that you are going to do during this week or this week. Just let me know, all right, when you finished. Go, teacher. Okay, go on, Nubia. Listo, teacher. Perfect. I'm going to visit my house. Okay. Uh, next uh, Thursday. All right, next Tuesday. Okay, Thursday. Thank you, Nubia. It was good, Roxana. Roxana, I didn't pay attention because there is like an interference. Tiene algún tipo de ruido, Roxana, o tiene algún micrófono externo con el cual está. Eh, está hablando o simplemente es el celular es que se escucha una interferencia no sé si solo yo le escucho o le escuchan los demás sí le escuchamos yeah, right. es que interferencia ah. solo estoy en la casa y no hay otra cosa prendida okay, pero, pero no está cerca de ningún otro dispositivo que le genere esa interferencia no. como una bocina cerca I don't know. Uh -uh. No, ah, okay. hecho, como ventilador se escucha, no sé. No tengo el ventilador encendido. Ok, ah, pues, pues el otro, hay alguien más ahí. No les diga uh, del pues, micrófono, quizás la tiene. Presencia plota. maligna. Okay. Exacto, eso le iba a decir, la espiga del micrófono. Ajá, Roxana, le suena mal conectada. Te miramos unos dos, vaya por la puerta. Y Natalia ya quiere salir corriendo. <ríe> una, una cara veo que está atrás. <ríe> no, la espiga, la espiga del micrófono. Pero, Ajá, pero... Rosana, check it. Ajá, check that. Pero no tengo conectado nada al teléfono. Simple. Ahora ya se oye bien. Ok, Rosana, read, read the example. La, 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 that way. Probablemente. Uh, okay. I am going to visit my doctors. Ah, okay, very good. Ajá, ahora se le entiende un poquito más. A la hora, Patricia. Okay, good. Thank you, Roxana. All right, Mrs. Posada, go on. Okay, I am going to a training on Friday. Ah, okay, very good. Thank you. Who's next? Who got it finished? Yo. Okay, I go on. To visit my sisters. Ah, okay, very good. Who's next? Carla. I'm going to visit Chalatenango. Ah, okay, I'm going to visit Chalatenango. Okay, very good. Who's next? Ever, do you finish? I am going to have my son's birthday. No, okay, very good. Or, or, or you might, or you might say, I'm going to celebrate. That would be better. Celebrate my son's birthday. Good. What's next? All right, we got a variety of people. Porque están así de uraños. Sara. Okay, okay. Okay, William, William, go, William. And then Sara. I, I'm going to go a party. Ah, okay, Next very week. good. Okay. Ah, okay, cool, William, thank you. Hey, I'm missing going to party. 
Wow. I'm going to hat um Evans liquor. Okay. okay, repeat again. Repeat again, Sara. I'm going to hat Evans and Evans the liquor. Un evento de licores. Ah, okay, okay, okay. A liquor store. Huh? Mm -hmm. Good. I'm a bit, you might have the first client there. <laughs> okay, Zara. Hilmar. Thank you, Zara. Hilmar, let's go. I'm going to go to the beach on Saturday night. Okay, very good. I'm going to go to the beach. On Saturday night. Next. I'm going to activities at my daughter's school. Read again, Sarah. I mean, Diana. No, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, that, that's the idea. I want, I want to check. I am. Mm -hmm. I am going to activities. All right, all right. At my uh, daughter's school. Ok, ahí antes de activity tiene que tener un verbo en forma base. I am uh -huh. going to, ok, y luego tener un verbo en forma base ahí. You need a verb, Diana. Um, uh -huh. Necesitamos un verbo um, que nos indique acción, Diana, there. Change it. Try to modify that. Trate de incluir un verbo ahí, Diana. ¿Ok? After going to, tiene que ir un verbo okay. tal y como tiene en las, en las oraciones. Fátima. Okay. I'm going to pay my bills next Friday. Ah, ok. Good. Hey, talking about paying the bills, I haven't paid mine. Oh, my God. And supposedly... Hey, yes. <laughs> yes. Y se supone que tengo esta mañana, como siempre, todo un trabajo. <laughs> okay, thank you, Fatima, to remind me that I got to pay a lot of things. Oh, my God. I'm not going to have money. Okay, uh, let's see who's next. Rosa. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, teacher, ya pasó lista. Not yet. It's because I'm compensating the time, Ana Maria. Es porque de cierta manera voy a compensar el tiempo que... Es que al principio de la clase tuve ciertos problemas de conectividad, Ana María. Mm. That's why. Right? Pero ya casi. Right after I finish this, okay. I'm going to do it. But thank you for reminding me. Okay. Uh, where is Rosa? Rosa, your example. I am going to visit my uncle on the weekend. Mm, okay. All right. Hey, todos van de visita ahora. Cool. Uh, Jonathan. Uh, sería, are you, uh, no, se quiero ver. Con positiva. Are, are, uh, en pregunta. Uh, ok, si tiene una pregunta, like, like, tell it. Read it. Ok. Are you going to use the application Shivo when out? No, okay, all right, it's valid that one. That is a yes, no question. Yes, I am, or no, I'm not. That would be the answer. Okay, Jonathan. Okay. All right, it's valid. Mrs. Rutia, did you participate already? Stephanie. Hello. Yeah. Okay, can you please read your example? <laughs> Yes, I'm going to go to the beach on my birthday. No, okay, very good. And when is your birthday to go <laughs> and celebrate it? Yes, September 14th. 14th, really? Yes. Por poco Sí, ya casi me ponían ahí de, de poste deteniendo el la bandera. <laughs> yes. Ok, cool, go for you. Le vamos a mandar algo con Natalie ahí. Eso. Yes, right, Natalie. Pero que se lo dé porque, porque si no, Natalie. Pero que sea que... azul y blanco. Ah, okay. <risa> Qué malo. Ok, good. 
Ah, pues ahí me manda algo a mí, teacher. When is your birthday? Nine, el 9. September? Yeah. Ah, cool. How, uh, no vamos a estar estudiando quizás todavía. Ah, no. I oh, think, yeah. I think on na, uh, September the 9th means, let me see. El 13 se supone que empieza el otro. Probably eh, not. Ah, pues no vamos a, hey, no, voy a, voy a poder, no, no voy a poder. En, en, Probably en not, Ana María. I'm sorry, Ana María. Y yeah. esa noche me pueden invitar a cenar y yo no voy a estar, que, ay, no voy a ir a clase. Perfecto, me quedo. <risa> ah, ok, good, good. Yes. Ahí lo hay. Ahí me mandan unos totopostes. Creo que se llaman unas cositas duras. Yes. Yes. Ay, es me delicious. encantan esas. Yeah, I mean, esas delicious. cosas. Obviously. Sí. Claro que sí. <risa> eh, la cantidad de años que tenga, eh, esa es la cantidad de totopostes que le voy a mandar. Right. Ok. Igual a Ana María. Ana María, vamos a llenar una bolsa de quintal. Ah, pues solo 15. Si la niña 15 está cumpliendo. Sí, sí, sí. sí. <risa> okay. ok. Qué malo. ¿Por qué ríe? <risa> no cree. Ok, good. <risa> Romeo, read your example. I'm going to eat and family. Ok, I'm going to eat with the family. With the family. Ok, Romeo, thank you. I'm going to stop sharing a little bit for a moment and I'm going to pass the attendance list. Give me a second, people. Just give me a second. I need to go and, and pass the attendance list because it's like time and then we're going to continue with this. Ana Claribel. Ana. Ahorita. Ah. Uh, I am going to have my nephew's party the Sunday. Thank you, Ana. Thank you. Another way I'm passing the attendance list. Stay present too. Ana. También estamos pasando asistencia, Ana. Stay present. Oh. Ah, no, también ahorita voy a pasar asistencia. Ya, ya ahorita la mencioné. Stay present. Yes. Uh, Thank you, Ana. All right. Cool. Ana María. Present. Okay, good. Diana Gabriela. Present. Ah, okay, good. Hey, de pronto solo le veo la frente a Diana. Okay, good. Eric <laughs> Guillermo. Present teacher. Okay, good. Uh, Ever de Jesús. Present. Okay, perfect. Fátima Alejandra. Hey, where's Fatima? Present. Ah, okay. Thank you, Fatima. Sorry, Dalia is not here. Ilmar Cruz. Present. Perfect. Jonathan Alexander. Present, teacher. Okay, thank you. Carla Benacer. Present, teacher. Very nice. Natalie Vanessa. Present. Ok, very good. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Nice. Romeo Alexis. Present. Perfect. Rosa del Carmen. Ok. Uh, Roxana Yesenia. Present teacher. Very nice. Salvador Alfonso. Eh, ahí fue el quinto sueño. Uh, let's see. Sara Carolina. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Miss Stephanie Lisette. Present. All right, cool. Hey, ni por qué anda bien arregladita me enciende la cámara. My God. No, oh, my God. No, 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 me van a desgastar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Iba a ir desgastada. 
Sí, así se arruinan los peinados. Ah, ok. Yeah. Yes. Para que sea bien el, el, el delineado. Exacto. Ok, no se va a apoyar un ojo. Ok. okay. William, William Alberto. Parece. Ok, very good. Joanny. Hey, Joanny is not connecting. Mm. Stephanie Janet. Present. Ok, very good. So let's continue with this. I, I, we've got a lot of things to, 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 to share right now. All right, right after this, let's go on. Extra examples. Natalie, ring number one. We are going to do the homework. Okay. We are going to do the homework. Good. Diana, read the next one. They are going to play soccer. All right, they are going to play soccer. You see? So they is the subject, are going to, that's the structure to make future, and play soccer, right? That's a complement, okay? That is the complement that we got. Uh, let's see, let's continue. William, read this example for me, please. are going to finish class on Thursday. Okay, on Thursday. Thank you, William. So students are going to finish class on Thursday. All right, uh, next. Mrs. Janet. Okay, um, Carla is going to visit her family. Okay, very good. Thank you. Uh, and we got, I think, next. Sara. Jose is going to buy a new car. Okay, Jose is going to buy a new car. Very good. Okay, we got the last one in this case, Natalie. The dog is going to bark. Okay, the dog is going to bark. All right, people, from here, do you have any question related to how to create positive statements using the going to? Yeah, no, yeah, tell me. Teacher, uh, what is bark? Bark? What? What? Do dogs do no bien? ¿Qué hacen los perros cuando ven a alguien desconocido? Ah, ladrar. Exactly. That is bark. Sí, yo no copié eso. Sí, ah, es corre. Permítame, permítame. Vamos. Yo pensé otra cosa cuando me dijo que. <risa> 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 ¿En qué pensó? Okay, no me responda. Si en un dado caso no me escuchan, me avisan por favor, porque está una mega hiper tormenta acá. Cuesta escuchársele y, uh, y se escucha a lo lejos. Are you serious? Y mucha interferencia. <risa> <risa> Quizá ya no hagamos la clase porque no le escuchamos. Ay, las que tienen la cámara apagada no cuentan. Se le escucha cortado. Co Playing with me, right? <laughs> <Not> people. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Let's continue. Do you finish? Do you finish taking notes? Yes. Okay. Yes. Very good. Let's continue with this. 
Now let's start up with negative statements, right? Ya vimos cómo crear oraciones afirmativas, okay, talking about future. Now let's start up with negative statements. Let's start with the structure. Take a look at this. It's likely similar to the structure before, but what do we do in this case? They write down not between B and going to. That is the difference. It says we got subject plus B plus not plus going to plus member plus complement. Example. Diana, read this example. I am not going to have a meeting tomorrow. Thank you. All right, in this case, what is the only difference in comparison to positive statement? In this case, we write down not. And we say, I am not, okay? I am not going to have a meeting tomorrow. De ahí es para hablar sobre acciones a futuro que no vamos a realizar, okay? Just keep that on mind. Jonathan, read the second example. You are not going to call your client. Okay, thank you. You are not going to call your clients. Very good. Let's read the next one. Uh, let's see this. Romeo. She is not going to buy a new computer. 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 Okay. Thank you, Romeo. She is not going to buy a new computer. Right? So all those actions are in negative. Remember that. They are in negative. Okay. And let's read up the last one, Hilmar. He's not going to go to golf. Okay. He is not going to go out. Right? El no saldrá. So this is part of how to make right, negative statements using this picture. Así le dice la esposa de Eric cuando llegan los, los amigos, quizás. What do you say, Herman? Así le dice, así dice la esposa de Eric cuando llegan los amigos. <laughs> <laughs> Él no saldrá, es por su bien. Yes. Y luego dice que, o sea, todo, todo lo que la esposa le dice es por su bien. Right, Eric? <laughs> Pobre Eric. No digo nada porque hay no. nada. Ah, no se oye, dice. No se oye, se escucha cortado. No dice nada porque la parla tiene. Ya van a ver un sartén de teflón no. ahí volando por la cabeza. Estoy libre de pecado en ese momento. <risa> la risita de la Ana María. Y que me da risa. Solo me qué mentira se le oye. Solo, so, el, me imagino el sartén <risa> volando así por el aire, así como dice el teacher. Va pasando enfrente de la cámara. Sin atinarle, dice, le va a dar. <risa> okay. ok, let's continue, let's continue. <risa> you got it there. Espérese, teacher, que estamos... Ok. Let's finish copying that information. Okay, right up to now, people. Do you have any questions? Hasta acá, ¿tienen alguna pregunta con relación a cómo crear relaciones negativas usando be going to? Something that might not be key for you, people? Everything is okay? That is Finish teacher. Perfect. Okay, now let's start up with things or activities that you don't longer have for this week or this week. 
Okay. Uh, I will give you one minute for you to tell me or you to write down an activity example that you are not going to do this coming weekend. For example, I am not going to work in the afternoon, right? Now, tell me your examples. What activities are not going, you are not going to do this coming uh, weekend? Let me know when you're finished. Teacher, casi no le entendí lo que dijo. All right, que ahora quiero que usted me haga un ejemplo sobre una actividad que no va a desarrollar este fin de semana. Okay. Okay, Lidia. Go on. I am not a cook. The, I, the, the weekend. I am not cooking. I am okay. not going to cook. I am okay. sick. sick. Alright. Your sure. Okay, Stephanie, go on. I am not going to the visit my family on the weekend. All right, Stephanie. Listen, listen, listen. I am not going to going <laughs> going. Repeat again. Going to. I am not going to visit my family on the weekend. Igual, todavía le falta el verbo en forma base, Stephanie. Say it again. I am not going to. Go. All right. Recordemos que el going to solamente pertenece a la estructura para formar futuro. Más no indicar que va a ir a algo. ¿Ok? So, en ese caso vamos a necesitar después del going to, el verbo go. Yo, teacher. Ok, give me con Ana María. Uh -huh. uh, Stephanie is going to repeat the, 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 the example. Stephanie. Um, I, am, I am not. Uh -huh. Going to. Going to. Yes, go, go, going go to go visit my family. Okay, very, very good. good. Thank you, Stephanie. Now, Ana Maria. Sí, casi igual. I am not going to go to visit church. Teacher. Como cuando le dicen, ¿verdad? Mira, aquí está la tarea. Modifíquela y solo le cambia el nombre. Pero yo ya la tenía. No, no, María. All right. Good. Uh, who else? I am not going to run in the park on Sunday morning. Very good, Eva. Thank you. Okay, uh, all right, all right. Okay, first Sarah and then Rosana. I am not going to have class on the weekend. <laughs> y lo hizo tan feliz. <laughs> Bien relaxed. <laughs> okay, yeah, I mean, me too. I feel like relaxed. <laughs> Yeah, I can't sleep more. <laughs> okay, Sara. Rosana, got your example? I am not going to boy in super selectos. Ah, uh, read again, Rosana. I am not I am not going to boy in super selectos. I am not going to go, right? Go. Uh -huh. I am not going to go. Super selectos. Super selectos. Okay, very good. Thank you, Rosana. Natalie. Uh, 
Um, I am not uh, going to work on Saturday. Okay, very good. You're not going to work, Natalie, on Saturday? Normalmente, sí. Normally, yeah. Sí. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of happy because I finish work at five on Saturdays. But this coming Saturday, I'm going to finish at 12. Right? No, yo trabajo hasta el mediodía. Uh, igual a mí, entonces, bueno, hasta este sábado pasado salí a trabajar hasta las 5. Ahora va a ser Ay, no. Sí, ahí, en el slide. Yes. <risa> so happy, era, que era hora, ¿eh? Yes, of course, que era hora. Fátima. Uh, I am not going to visit, to go visit my sister. Ah, ok. Thank you, Fatima. Okay. La siempre feliz Rosa. <laughs> Rosa. Estaba pensando en otra porque va a decir que la copié. Y no la copió, Rosa. Que se parece a la de Natalie. Ay, pero qué curioso. A ver, léala. I am not going to work this weekend. You should change it, Rosa. You should change it. Ya me por si estaba pensando en otra. Okay, but I, I will accept it, okay? I will. I will accept it. Uh, thank you, Rosa. Carla, you read yours? Okay, do it. I not I not going to work to weekend. Uh oh, okay, very good. You're not going to work two weekends. Hmm, nice. William. I not going to go buy to buy. Uh, okay. The supermarket. No, okay. Very good. Thank you, William. Jonathan. Okay. Teacher, um, my example is, and uh, you, you are not going to visit your family because we go to the stadium. No, nah, because we go to the stadium. Good. A ver en la aliancita. La selecta. Ah, ya yeah, me. Hey, when, it, when are they going to play? ¿Cuándo van a jugar? Jueves 2 de septiembre contra Estados Unidos. Qué desactualizado han dado eso. <risa> ya voy a estar libre. I mean, to, I mean, I mean, to watch it, right? To watch it. Que no era el domingo que jugaban. No. Bueno, el 2, no sé cuándo cae, yo creo que jueves. Ya. Yeah. Sí, el jueves. El domingo, el domingo también juegan. Eh, yo feliciano ahí que, que iba a verla y es el último día de clase. Es que el domingo creo que juegan con Honduras. Ah, es ah. Ay, que había oído de alguien. Yeah. Supuestamente uh -huh. el domingo. Ok. Uh, let's see who's next. Who's next? I think I got the feeling of someone is missing. Romeo? Okay. I am not going to play football. Okay, I am not going to play soccer. Soccer. That would be better. Soccer. Okay. Mrs. Rutia? I'm not going to go to supermarket on weekend. Okay. Another example. I am not going to go to the party tonight. <laughs> that would be cool. Hoy es lunes, teacher. Huh? Yes, great. Good. 
All right, let's continue. Okay, negative statement example. These are extra examples. Uh, Romeo, give me a second. This is not, this is a question actually. All right, instead of putting up negative statement, give me a second. This is positive. Give me a second, people. Uh, give me a second, Romeo. I need to fix something there. All right, give me a second. Okay, I got it double this thing. There you go. Now it is the one. Okay, these, these were like the ones that we were practicing. Questions. Okay, and we got the structure. And this is the structure. Look, when we ask questions using be going to, we generally start with B at the beginning. All right, recordemos que B generalmente suele ser un verbo auxiliar. Entonces acá en la estructura, B en pregunta va a modificarse y va a pasar a primer, ok, a, digamos, a tomar la primera posición en una pregunta. Ok, and we got B, after B, we got subject. Después de B tenemos el sujeto. Remember, the subject can be a pronoun or a, or a proper noun. Ok, recuerden que el subject puede ser un pronombre o nombre propio. And then we have going to, y al final we got member in complement. We got an example. Romeo, read the example. Are you going to buy food tonight? Tonight, very good, Romeo, thank you. Are you going to buy food tonight? What type of question is this? Remember, this is a yes, no question. ¿Por qué es una yes, no question? Porque no tenemos what, where, when, why, who, ok? Al principio no tenemos las WS words. Por eso esta pregunta es una yes, no question. It is like, are you going to buy food tonight? ¿Comprarás comida esta noche? Yes, I am. Positive statement. Or no. I'm not. That's a negative statement, okay? So this is pretty much how we got it. All right, another example. Mrs. Janet. Mm -hmm. Are you going to dance after class? Um dance yes um no i'm not no i'm not very good no yeah are you going to text during the class is an example no yeah <laughs> not teacher I'm, I'm not <laughs> no i'm not okay thank you no yeah so okay. kind. Of. All right, Nuya. No, no, no. Take it. Hey, Nuya. I want you to ask one question to Eric. Okay. Um, Eric, are you going to eat uh, dinner after class? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Thank you, Nuya. Eric. I want you to ask one question to Carla. Carla, are you going to do the homework tonight? 
Yes, I am. Uh -huh. Por cierto, alguien que me debe mucho este espacio. No, no, no hablo de usted, Carla. I'm talking about general. I'm talking Teacher, about... yo voy al día. Yes, yes. Por eso, por eso aclaré. Ok. Thank you, Eric. Now, Carla, I want you to ask one question to Roxana. Ok. Roxana, are you, are you going to foot in the class? Uh, are you going to? Uh, pardon. Are you going to eat in the class? No, okay. Roxana? Are you going to eat in the class, Roxana? Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Ya vemos entonces. Thank you, Roxana. I mean, Carla. Now, Roxana, I want you to ask one question to Fatima. Fatima, are you going to have um, is dog? Are you going to have a dog? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Why not, Fatima? Dogs are really cool. Sí, pero is my house is very little, pequeña. Very small. Very small. Ah, y oh. pasaría solo. Ah, really? Uh -huh. mm. <laughs> yeah. I got two beautiful people in here. They like playing with 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 every people that comes to the house. Yeah. Okay, Fatima. Uh, thank you, Rosana. Now, Fatima, I want you to ask one question to Rosa. Okay. Con la siempre sonriente Rosa. <laughs> Are you going to go to go to work? Oh my God. Me fue el internet. 